Question 12, let's get our highlights out. We've got five cards. One, two, three, four, five. We don't know what's in the fifth card. There is a whole number from zero to nine on each card. Okay, so in each of these cards, it's some whole number um, from zero to nine. The, the number on the last card is hidden. The range of the numbers is equal to six. Write down the whole number on the last card. Now let's think about this. The range, this is key. We have to know what the meaning of the word range is. Okay, so we're told that the range of the numbers is six. Now the range means the biggest number, take away the smallest. The biggest, subtract the smallest, right? Now, the biggest number currently we've got is, is, an, is an 8. So let's assume that this isn't a 9, because uh, 9 take away uh, the smallest number 4 would, would, would be equal to um, 5, which is not the range. So 8 is the biggest number. Now let's subtract the smallest. Now, the smallest currently is 4. 8 subtract 4 is equal to 4, which is not 6. So what could this number be in order that you get the answer 6? You want the range to be 6. You're told the range is 6. If the biggest number you've got is 8, what does this number need to be in order to get 8 subtract something would give you 6? Well, the answer would be 2 because 8 subtract 2 is equal to 6. It's the only number you can have in order to get that range to be the one you want it. So therefore the answer here is two. Now let's move on. Here is a different set of five cards. Different set of five cards. There is a different whole number from zero to nine in each card. Each one must be different. So let's just quickly think about this. We've got zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. We have already used seven, we have already used 4, we have already used 3, and we have already used 6. So this card must be a 0, 1, 2, an 8, or a 9. The number on the last card is hidden. The median of the, of the, of the 5 cards is 4. Which uh, whole numbers could the last card be? Now, in order to work out the median of something, you've got, the, you've got to put them in order from smallest to biggest. So... Let's um, put them in the order we've got here. So we've got a 3, that we've got a 4, we've got a 6, and we've got a 7. Now clearly, if I pick a number here, if my other number is bigger than 7, say if it's 8 or something, then the median would turn out to be, so whatever uh, this one is here, if I pick that to be 8, 9, or something, the median would be 6, which is not what we want. We want the median to be 4. We want this to be the middle number. So our number our other card must be smaller than 3. If So let me explain that again. If it was here, the median would be forced to be the middle of 5 numbers, the middle of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 numbers. It would make it equal to 6. We don't want that. So what we want is the number must be here so that the middle is 4 because we're told the median is 4. So what numbers could it be? Well, therefore, what numbers do we have that are smaller than 3? It could be a 0, a 1, or a 2. So 0, 1, or 2 are our possibilities.